Hey all, once a future gamer here, welcome back to this playthrough of Fable 2. So last time we did the uh, DLC, the Cursed Snow Globe, it was the first time I ever did that, so... Interesting experience. Today though, we're going to go back and see the Abbot. We're going to prove ourselves worthy. Title today. Hey, it's Sparrow. How's it going? Ooh, I could afford that. Can I get better weapons? Maybe we can do a special offer for you. Ah, that could be that could be worth a purchase. I do like a ranged attack. Anyway, let us head back to the Abbot. Back to the Temple of Light, here we go. As I said on a previous episode, that's my plan for this. Put prices high, get the money, buy what I need, and then lower it as almost as low as it can go from corruption to benevolence that will work it's you i prayed for your return i heard what you did in rookridge I think you could be of great use to us. Come, walk with me a while. Let's -a go. Now, nourishing the golden acorn is done with holy water from the well spring of light. But the spring is located in a nearby cave, which is said to be quite dangerous. Our sacred text says two monks must enter this cave, the strongest and a second of the abbot's choosing. Obviously this concerns me, especially since the strongest monk here is my own child. Not much of a monk then, is I? So instead of a second monk, I have chosen to send a protector for the first. And that's you, if you're interested. The cave is just at the end of this road. You probably passed it on your way here. No, well, maybe I did. Our strongest monk will be waiting for you when you're ready. Now then. Our first hero awaits us. Even if they do not yet realize it. The time is very late. <clears throat> Let's keep oh okay. Nice, nice. No well, because I can almost outrun a dog. That's the speed feat we're going with. Anything in this direction? Swim the sirens of Oak Vale Out to the seas Ah, 
I knew my lovely singing voice would bring the crowds. So you're my escort then? My father said you'd be coming by. Hey there, boy. Hello. Oh, you're a strong, handsome fellow, aren't you? I feel better having you with me in that cave. Yes, I will. Typical, the dog gets all the love. I'm Sister Hannah. Some people call me Hammer when they think they're being clever. They're not. But I can't do much about it because monks make a solemn vow never to bash anyone's face it. Did my father mention that? Yeah. Whatever fighting's to be done in there, it's all yours. We require a hero, not a pacifist monk. We'll need her to find a reason to fight. I don't mind telling you, I'm a bit envious. You get all the excitement and I get to carry this bloody thing like some sort of mule. I mean, look at it. It's enormous. Golden or not, how much water does a bloody acorn need? Well, point taken. After you. I'm already going to see the benefits from buying that house. And when I buy one house and the money starts rolling in, I buy another house. And then I bleed the land dry. It's amazing when you think about it. No one else has been in here for maybe a hundred years. Well, no monks anyway. I guess an adventurer or two could have come in, but if they got out alive, I didn't hear about it. Hmm. Anyway, look up there. They're lovely. I think they're called wisps. Souls of the dead who never left this world. <clears throat> it's actually rather sad, isn't it? Oh yeah, I'm remembering what's coming now. You are a quiet one. Watch your step, doggy. Looks a bit steep here. Do you reckon we'll run into anything nasty in here? I mean, a dark, creepy cave is a hell of a place for a holy spring. Especially for an order of pacifists. You know, I've heard of monks in the north who believe that to transcend violence, you have to understand it first. Alright, this should be the central chamber. Wow, I've never seen anything like this, ever. Now, according to my father, we need to go through these three doors in order to collect the water. Putting weight on the pressure plates will open the doors. This one's the first. Let's keep going. Far, far too quiet so far. You know something's going to go wrong somewhere. Now, there are two plates in this room. It'll take both of us to get the water flowing. I stand here so I can catch it. And you need to stand on that one. Right, there it goes. Oh yeah, I can feel this thing getting even heavier. That's nice, that is. So far, this isn't too bad. A couple of steep bits, but that's it. I really hope they find someone else to do this next time. Mind you, I'll be an old lady by then, so I'm probably off the hook. You know, this is probably going to be the highlight of my life. The day I carried a jug through a cave. Doesn't sound great, does it? Hardly epic poem stuff, is it? Did you hear something? No. Probably just my imagination. 
Don't talk much, do you? Right, I reckon that's all the water we're going to get from this one. Dog's got to splash in. Here we go. Good dog out. to pay the bills. And we got to do that twice more. I just learned a new skill. I know you're looking at something heavy, but come on, sometime today. That was fantastic. Those things didn't stand a chance. Have you ever fought them before? Sure looked like you had. That when you're a very fast learner. I don't see any wisps now. And no hollow men followed us. You killed one thing in this game, this you've killed them all. Oh, I remember this bit. Right, here's the next one. I'll stand by the fountain to catch the water, same as before. Something bad's gonna happen. Ah, oh, brilliant. Just have to wait until this thing stops running. You'd think they would have made this jug with a flat bottom in case you want to have a rest. But as it is, it would just tip over, and then where would you be? Oh, bugger, here they come! These suckers make good targets, huh? Da 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 da
<laughs> we got it eventually. One more round, maybe. where the ground falls out from under your feet. Be cautious. She's not wrong. What in the world was that? Are you ready for whatever that was? I'll be fine. Okay. I'm getting worried now. <laughs> yep. What you got there? Oh, I Oh, we got him. Oh, I reckon he's dead. Well, I mean, you know what I mean. Dead Earth. Wow, that was amazing. We killed a lot of them. 
Phew. I was really worried for a moment there. Well, for several moments. I... Thank you. You were brilliant. On we go, then. This is it. This is the final <coughs> room. Should be nearly done now. I know I said that before, but hopefully this time it's true. I think that's the last play over there. Lords of Light, bless this water, that with it we may give rise to new life once more. As new life rises, so shall we. Sister Han. Brother Robin? What is it? It's your father. One of Lucian's men. He's holding him hostage at the temple. He's got a gun. I have to save my father. <sighs> Come on. We have to get to the temple. One of Lucian's agents has come to the temple. Go after her. Here we go. I don't think you saw it going that way. Father! I could have stopped him! You idiot! You stupid fool! I could have stopped him if I... I'm sorry, Father. Not that I broke my vow. I'm sorry I didn't break it sooner. I never did fit in at this place. We both knew that. And now I'm making a new vow. Lucian will die for what he did to you. <laughs> I won't break this one. This is incredibly Sister disrespectful. Hannah, the blessing. You do it. As new life rises, so shall we. As the sea returns to the earth, so do we all. Is that it then? My father's gone. The golden oak is flourishing again. So now life just goes on as before, does it? The other monks may believe that, but your eyes have been opened. Where did you come from? Who are you? Someone who can tell you much about Lucian. Where he is, what his plans are, and how you can gain your revenge, if you will listen. I want to know everything. Then come with me, Sister Han. Call me Hammer. Woo! I've taken Hammer to the guild. You've done well, hero. You have gathered the first of the three heroes, and we are one step closer to defeating Lucian's plans. 
it will take some time for Hammer to overcome her grief and longer to explain her role in Lucian's downfall. Perhaps this would be a good time to upgrade your equipment. I believe there is a sale in Bowerstone. It may well be worth a visit. Come back to the guild when you are ready. Can't afford that yet. I love you. You know what? Can buy that though. Ooh. Worth it. I think I'm going to call it a session here, so thanks for watching. I'm going to call it out now. Have a good day, and see you next time. Bye-bye now. So long. I will see you.